you were named CEO of the New York Times in August 2012. At the time, shares were about $9 a share. Today, they're 46 and change. So I'm not a math major, but that's like a 400% plus gain. Um, yeah, kind of fun. Or yeah, five exactly. Six X. Five, five, five yeah. X. Right. Um, how'd you do it? <laughs> well, I mean, I feel about my time at the New York Times that it's like the, the, the company was ready to change. I mean, I think that the, the pent up demand for innovation and taking some risks and trying some new stuff was all there. And the company needed somebody to give them permission to do that. And I, I was able to do that. I was able to come in and say, you know, um, if you look at, if you look at our current track, we're not going to make it. The digital revenue in the end is not growing quickly enough to offset the inevitable declines on the print side. Um, so we better change our tactics and, and try some bigger, bolder stuff. And I think to their great credit, the company, you know, the newsroom the, and the business side both basically said yes to that. 